Hey guys, I wanted to get into this uh, fork issue that uh, uh, wasn't disclosed here on this uh, information here. Uh, let's see. Um, just doing a service on the fork um, seal and new oil and all that stuff. And um, let me uh, break this down real quick here. So we have a dust cover. We have the locking ring. We also have the uh, shaft seal, as they call it, or the fork seal. Below that, we had the uh, the washer or the ring, and then below that, they call it the bushing. Um, what they're not showing on here is a segment of other things that are down inside of the uh, the fork, which I just can't believe that uh, on my K1200 LT they're not showing it in here for some reason. Um, there's like a nylon bushing here. Let me uh, show you what we got here real quick. Here's our uh, basic dust dust cap or sill. Here's our retaining ring. Here's our uh, fork seal. Um, here's that uh, washer and then here is the uh, bushing that they were talking about. What they're not showing is this. It's like a nylon bushing is the best way I can describe it. It sits underneath this one. There's four of them down in there at least. And I believe that there's at least two more of these bushings below at the very bottom uh, where the drain plug is. Um, they're just kind of stacked on top of each other. I believe that the bushing is to push down to hold everything else down in there. Um, I'm thinking that this nylon sort of uh, bushing is uh, for wear maybe for play or something like that. I don't know. I just know when I, I was tapping on mine, uh, noticed that there was a lot of dirt down at the very bottom, gummed up, uh, water mixture, and some other stuff. Um, and, uh, let's see here. <coughs> it's not very long. Maybe approximately four or so inches. Um, you know, but they just don't show it. They don't tell me what that is. I'm assuming it's a nylon bushing. But uh, anyway, I just was tapping on mine. The, the uh, bushing came out. And then along with that came these um, nylon bushings inside. I removed them. Uh, quite easily they slipped out. Um, and I was able to clean better. Uh, pretty much down to about where this mark is right here the, there's some retaining rings uh, further down at the very bottom here um, and I, I was able to clean most of this up uh, pretty well to get the dirt out of it. I had some very fine dirt maybe from my dust cap not being uh, so well but uh, uh, my bike had over 60,000 65,000 excuse me uh, when this was done. Oil was putrid, horrible smelling uh, when I took it out of there. So this was long overdue. Um, should have approximately about 16 ounces um, of fluid in there, I believe it was. Um, the um, <laughs> of course, I wrote it down. I can't find it. Anyways, uh, double check on that. I, I, I'm pretty sure it was right around uh, 16 ounces uh, for each side to go in there. So um, I only only had 14 in mind, so I knew mine was leaking. Hope uh, some of this information helps um, on what all those little pieces are when you take them out, and if you happen to tap on it or this inner ring comes out, you know that these just slide back in, clean everything up real nice, make it 
and put it back together. Hope that helps.